Hi, my friends. How are you guys all doing? I hope you're doing so well. I really miss you guys, and I hope you're having a lot of fun at home with your parents and your brothers and sisters. Today, I'm going to read you guys a little book. I'm going to read How to Dress a Dragon. Has anybody read this before? Does anybody have this at home? If you do, you can grab it and read with me. So here we go. This book's pretty funny. If you have to dress a dragon, you must be prepared to catch him as he flies by. You may have to tickle tackle him to the floor and give him belly kisses. <laughs> Once your dragon is still, it will be time to put on his underwear. The good thing is dragons love underwear, especially their froggy superhero ones. Silly dragon. Ha <laughs> ha. What is he doing? He has his froggy underwear on his head. You might have to sit saddle on your dragon to put his socks on because dragons have very tickly toes. Silly dragon. Dragons do not like shirts with buttons. Dragons do not like shirts that pull over their heads. Dragons do not like shirts. But they do like capes. Dragons prefer shorts instead of pants. Shorts are much easier to put on with big old dragon feet. Shoes can also be tricky. Please, dragon, don't scrunch up your toes. But if you let your dragon wear his froggy boots, he's going to be really happy. Ooh, I see a lot of you guys have boots pretty similar to his boots. Dragons are also very picky about their hats. They will only wear hats that fit nicely between their horns like this one. They don't like these ones very much. When your dragon is all dressed, he will want to go outside and play. At least I hope you guys are getting to go outside and play in your backyards. It's very nice outside today. But beware if he wants to play his favorite game of dragon and knight. Your dragon will insist, oh, he's kicking all his clothes off, on being, do you think he's going to be the dragon or the knight? Let's see. Silly knight. Oh, of course, he wanted to dress up as the knight, and he made his little friend dress up as the dragon. That silly dragon. And now they're enjoying looking at the moon sitting on top of their house with their cat. <laughs> the end. Thank you guys for listening, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.